I know our last update was a trying to conceive update and basically that we hadn't conceived negative pregnancy, negative LH, yada yada. Six days later, I think, I've lost track, but less than a week later, I was taking, I just want to know when I'm ovulating, so I was taking ovulation tests and I have a whole bunch of pregnancy tests too, so I was taking one of those every now and then and I was like, hold on a second, I see a line. It's so faint, but it was on multiple tests of multiple brands, but they were all the really cheap brands. I don't think I'm pregnant, but there's a chance. So, we take a first response. Oh, that's definitely one line. Oh, see, I can see another line again. I don't know. Well, I got lines. Very, very faint lines on two cheap, crappy tests. Yeah, I know, but I know the good one's gonna be negative. Because I got a hope while there's faint lines on these ones. Two, three, four, five. Start the three minute timer. <sighs> Where's the first line? I think. <coughs> Oh, well, I put her face down and then I could look first. I'm oh, sorry, you can look. I just haven't been looking. You can't put them face down, so. Yeah, no. <laughs> I keep looking, it might appear. It's negative, sir. I don't say. Yeah. Me next. Ow. We all saw it coming. It was negative. Hopefully the next time I post a video it won't be, but you never know. But we're, we're only early days and I'm still breastfeeding, so all's great. I just desperately hoping that my endometriosis isn't back again. But I'm gonna show you guys my little thing. So this is my journal of pregnancy testing and ovulation testing and everything as you can see I used to do it a lot more often like day 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 pretty much every day um, since I got my implant on out but um, it gets a bit more few and far between as the time goes on um, but yeah I'm, at, I'm up to th this was the day that this video is taken as you can see I got a bit carried away okay ignoring the top one because that's LH so there should be a line there can you guys see the lines I'm seeing they're a lot harder to focus on in the camera but like, like look at that one and that one like they're so visible but also not that was day 84 day 85 I took another one just to double check actually took another three and they were all well this one first response was negative and the rest were like negative two so maybe a faint line again but not enough to show anything and I haven't tested since so we continue waiting and we continue trying and hopefully we'll get pregnant eventually Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe to see more videos and follow along for the rest of our trying to conceive baby number two journey. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye, peoples.